Here's a quick video on what the original tension pulley sounds like before I take it off the motor. Take a listen here. because you have to remove the idler pulley to get access uh, of the bolt that's holding down the, the tensioner also. To remove the tension pulley I would need to uh, remove two bolts. They're 13 millimeters. There's one up here and one underneath. And what I'm going to do is go ahead and loosen this bolt first and then release the tension so this pulley will actually swing out a little bit and I can access the lower bolt on the back side of it, on the lower side, underneath. Here we go. Can't do it with one hand so I'm going to shut down, shut down the video and get this thing started and I'll be right back. Here's a quick video showing the difference between an old tensioner pulley, what it sounds like versus the brand new one here on the right. So here's the old one. Real dry sounding. You can see. Okay, and here's a brand new one. Actually, let me put my foot on it. That's what it sounds like. All right, uh, I've just installed the brand new tensioner pulley uh, back on. And this is what it sounds like when it's on. Perfect.